For me, I'm super passionate about getting more people cycling walking purely because you can do it as a professional sport, but it's about more than that. For me, it's about the health and well-being factor of it. Statistics are saying that one third of people only do 10 minutes of walking per month and that has to change. So the infrastructure plans that the West Midlands have and what I'm involved in as well is getting some really high-end infrastructure, not just painting you know, lines on the, on the road and doing the generic easy things to do, but actually things that are high quality that people will be enthusiastic about actually taking part in and then part, making it a part of their life, healthy lifestyles. So with the, the likes of the Better Streets Community Funds, people have obviously put their projects in that they would like to be seen and over the next coming months, up and coming months, you'll start to see them projects actually rolling out and that's when it's going to get exciting. People are going to see things come, you know, come to light and actually the projects they need support and help with, that's going to start happening. My favourite thing about Let's Ride, I always enjoy coming to the events and this one in Coventry today has been absolutely brilliant and, and just seeing like families taking their children there, you know, they're not worried about the traffic and everything else that's a barrier to them, but they're just out there enjoying the beautiful sunshine, some of them are pushing the kids alongside them and they're all laughing and some of them painted with tiger faces because of the stalls that's available and it's for free. So yeah, hopefully, you know, more of these and the momentum that carries on forwards and the barriers and obviously the projects that we can be involved in and helping, you know, making people feel safer on the roads, whether that be walking or cycling, I think, yeah, we'll hopefully see a, a completely different picture this time next year.